Space. Final frontier. That's what it's called, right? It's beautiful. Endless. Feel the warmth of the sun millions of kilometers away on my skin without any atmosphere to stand between us. The upside is it's a truly amazing feeling. The downside is I'm truly about to die. Who would have guessed I'd die floating alone in space? You know, I mean, until now, I'd never been any higher up than the top floor of my apartment building, and I only went up there once. My mistake. It all started yesterday. Ordinary day like, uh, like any other. It's un until I got hit on the head. Ouch! Jeez! That was a three-star impact, Wally. Uh, this one needs some work. Three stars? You sure, Ray? R&D insists that this one be a one-star hot hat. One and a half tops. That's some quality hot hats you're testing. You want to trade spots and see for yourself? Three stars. Didn't notice any birds flying around my head, though. Uh, that's something. All right. This one's next. It's a new material R&D wants to try. It says here it's based mostly on... Recycled banana peels and used juice boxes. Say by the bell, huh? Oh, see you tomorrow, buddy. Ooh, that would have sucked. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Stick It to the Man. I don't remember when I got this game, but it seems interesting. And I'm going to be playing it, obviously. Can I, can I talk to my coworker? No? Oh. Oh, I, I have to go left. Then I'll go right. Ray, I hate to be the one to tell you this, but you actually live all the way to the left. Weird, huh? Yeah, yeah, I know. What is that? Oh. Ooh. Ooh. What's this for? Is it in case I die? Hard hat tested. No experience required. It seemed like such a good idea at the time. <laughs> Can I talk to these two? Can I go to the disco with them? No. Can't do anything right now. Okay. Why would you design a city like this? So many people will die. This is Gamma 3. We've encountered storm systems too large to go around without delaying landing time. Uh, please advise. Gamma 3? Sean, you told me your name was Jimmy. <laughs> well, that one ain't well. Who's this guy? Can I jump in my doom? No? Not right now? Okay. Somehow, I always forget how much jumping is required to get to and from work. Yeah, that sucks. For you. So many people I can't talk to. This game looks so good so far. <laughs> it reminds me a little of Parappa the Rapper. Just the character design. Gamma 3 calling base. Please respond. Base, storm now intensifying beyond safety thresholds. Uh, unusually intense lightning activity observed. Attempting to abort uh, emergency support requested. Wow! Plane made out of paper can't take the heat, huh? Or even a little rain? I bet those eggheads you thought of a paper airplane was a great idea because it wouldn't be detected by enemy radar. I'm feeling pretty <laughs> smart right now. Tell me you didn't get him to redesign our parachutes, too! <laughs> Does he might have look on his face? He probably did. <laughs> mayday. Oh, Mayday! The lightning now at level 5 alert. The Omega level package is in danger. Repeat, the Omega level package... Oh, no, I appreciate your concern, but my package isn't... Here we go. It's 
gonna happen no matter what. <laughs> Five stars, Wally. <laughs> Five stars. Ooh, that thing is 3D. It must be an alien. It looks like a brain. Is it? What's it gonna do? Is it gonna eat my brain? Inhabit my body? What the? Where am I? What's this spaghetti arm doing sticking out of my head? Okay, stay calm, Ray. Last thing I remember was leaving work and jumping a lot and then getting it on the head. Of course! Uh, the hand growing out of my head and this whole crazy world is all a dream. Good assessment. You have to go right. So I'll go left. How does this hand work? I want to go up. Please, let me explore. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Hey, a bottle. Nice work, me. Ooh. I know my subconscious. This bottle will have something inside it to help me get off this island. You know yourself so well. Ooh. High five me, Ray. High five me, Ray. I give the best <laughs> high fives, Ray. High five me instead. You may think you know high fives, but you haven't experienced a high five until you've high five me! Please, please, crazy pin creatures, one at a time. I'll high five Ollie, I promise. Why not, right? Might as well use this crazy hand for something. And this looks like it'll be fun. How do I let go of this? Oh, crap. This arm is awesome! <laughs> yeah! Oh, I'm almost sorry, I'll have to wake up with this. <laughs> I'm on it. Calm down. I just did. Oh, it's me. And my brain. Is that my love interest? My better half? Or am I just an awkward loser that can't talk to her? Get on it. Aww. <laughs> How do I get rid of this cork? Oh crap. <laughs> it won't. I don't know how to get rid of it. Please go away. Fingers look familiar. Hmm. Ha. 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 Oh, wow, oh. no way. <laughs> A giant me robot. Hmm. Okay. So my head is flooded with elephant juice. And inside are a bunch of gears that aren't moving. Which probably means I'm knocked out and I need to drain the water from my brain. Got it. He's a smart guy. I can't hold my breath forever. <laughs> oh, and there's a creature swimming around in my head. Not sure what to make of that one, honestly. Uh, can you uh, hear me, little guy? Help! Hey, a sticker of a tap. I wonder if it's scratch and sniff. It is. <laughs> and it smells like a sticker. Neat. A pink elephant pouring water through a hole in my head. Hmm, I didn't bring my dream symbolism app with me, but I'm guessing this means I'm a confident handsome man that everybody loves. <laughs> Probably, right? Dream on. <laughs> I saved Guess you. I needed the Crazy cork after all. Thing. Finally. 
finally dry at last. But the controls don't work. I need power. If only there was a way to get that heart working again. It looks like my brain. But it also might be the alien from earlier. lives in Robot Me's heart, and she's calling for a dog named Heart. Dreams are crazy. Oh well, at least I'm not back in high school and also naked in this one. <laughs> Again. So she is your love interest. She's your goil. Just a figment of my imagination. And this is all a dream. You, I, it occurs to me that in real life, skeletons don't talk. Will you do an old sea dog a favor and dream me back to life again? Well, I, I kind of need to lead this dog back to my girlfriend. You've got an arm made of bone, so... I hear you, landlubber. Well... I'd be happy to lend a hand. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, he just realized how well lend a hand worked back there. <laughs> that wasn't even on purpose. <laughs> Alright, how can I help him out? Honor your deals, dude. Also, sorry if there's anything weird. You saw happen just now. I was making sure I was actually recording my voice. <laughs> heart, come. Come hither, heart. If you're supposed to give dogs bones. Heart, you came back. What a good girl. Who's a good girl? It's you, Heart. You're the best girl. Yes, you are. <laughs> I'm so happy. I love you, Heart. I always knew Eileen was the woman of my dreams. But it's nice to have it confirmed. <laughs> All the pieces are in place. I was just about to leave, but now I think I'll stay after all. Yes, I'll be able to stay here indefinitely, as long as the host survives. So it is the Wait, wait, what? Sir, there's been an incident. An incident? Uh, a crash, sir. And the subject is... missing. Why are you coming to me for instructions? Obviously, I'm going to tell you to find it. It's the most powerful weapon in the universe. Spaghetti! Sp spaghetti in my, my hand! 
Uh, me? <laughs> <laughs> wow! What a crazy dream! Oh, good thing dreams are stupid and don't mean anything! But we never dreamed a pirate a week, or alive. That'll be a lot easier than carrying you out. Huh? What will be easier than carrying me out? This! Get out! Ooh. What? Your insurance doesn't cover head injury, mister. Get out! What? Head injury? What? I work what in a my business head? where I get hey, hit in the head. Shoving. Oh, you just and it me doesn't cover head, head injuries? Hey, 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 easy on the That's buns. crap. He needs a better job. Is this the sneezy guy? Hmm. Oh, now I can talk to people. Hmm. This is one hell of a background. <laughs> Whoops. This bandage is all kinds of itchy. I should just tell it to him straight. Oh, this can't be happening. Ouch! <laughs> Careful, I will bet you don't want to do it. So, so shiny. Become a chef, say shit. You know, I can't do it without it. Holy crap. What the hell? Okay. Okay. I'm hallucinating. Arms don't grow out of heads. I just gotta get home and sleep this off. It, it's all a hallucination, that, that's all. It's uh, just a hallucination that lets me read minds accurately. Yeah, dude, huh. you're a psychic now. Hopefully, huh. the future won't huh. take over your mind or anything. Huh. Whoa. You listen, do me a favor. I kinda didn't think this through. Obviously. And I left the handbrake on in the car. Can you disengage it for me? Uh, actually, maybe you can do me a favor instead. I'm looking for a cab ride home and... I got my own problems here. Problems I do not want to talk about. Listen, thanks for nothing. I'm just gonna wait here till somebody else comes and disengages my car. Peace! Okay. Maybe... Uh, maybe I can use my... Hallucination brain arm to read his mind and find out what his problem is. I, I don't know. Barbara, if only you had left me for that mafia document, naughty spy. Oh, naughty spy. I can fast forward and rewind it. Bravra. Cool. If only you had left me for that mafia don with the mad nutty smile. If only my own smile had that sparkle that drives you wild. If only I could take back years of poor dental hygiene. If only I could have you back. Okay. I gotta find a way to help this dude get his lady friend back. Keep it up, Barbara. We'll win this competition for sure. Especially since my biggest challenger had an unfortunate accident. <laughs> what? Huh? What was that? Sorry, I was kind of lost in your teeth there. I just love your smile, Don. Uh, Don's my position, not my... Na uh, you know what, uh, Don's fine. <laughs> Honey, I don't care what you're called, as long as you keep showing me those sparkly teeth. Wow, she is... Not the kind of person that dude should be going for. For this guy. Can't stop this dance train. Okay. Ed, where are you? We've been practicing for weeks, and you promised you wouldn't stand me up. Don't do this to me, Eddie. I am an adult human, and my major criteria in selecting a mate is how shiny their teeth are. I may have made some bad decisions somewhere. However, on the 
other hand. Ooh, shiny teeth. <laughs> Some might say that murdering a man to win a dance competition <laughs> is sociopathic. But is it really sociopathic to only see people as obstacles to be overcome by any means possible? <laughs> Wait, maybe it is. Maybe that's actually the textbook symptom of sociopathy. Do it now. Damn, dude. What is this here? Down, down, down. Okay. The cursed road blockers. <laughs> Poor Bitey. All alone and lost in the sewer. Nobody to tuck him in at night. Nobody to give him his belly rubs and his teeth scratches. Bitey's such a gentle soul. He needs me to take care of him. Okay. Chicken. Chicken. I'm nature's greatest predator, buddy. <laughs> and I'm tired of chicken. I got a taste for special treats, and I ain't coming out for anything except human limbs, baby. Oh, okay. delicious human limbs. So long <laughs> and crunchy. So full of valuable vitamins and minerals. Okay. okay. This is a terrible decision on your part, dude. There's over here. Up there. Some guy's crying. What's up? Oh, what a kind and noble heart here <laughs> breaks. <laughs> this can't be real, can it? I thought we'd be together forever. Forever! Oh, I can't believe our relationship is over! <laughs> this oh, can't be real, can it? <laughs> no. Got that. There we go. What's up with you? This food is almost ready. But it needs one more spice. But what? Something that tastes of despair. <laughs> Something that is condensed, liquefied sorrow. Where can I find this ingredient? <laughs> I got your ingredient right here, dude. <laughs> oh, crap. Ah, la ingredient parfait. This meal, it is. This guy is terrifying. You can really taste this sorrow. I'll take that. Thank you. What's up with this lady? I hate to see him hurt, but it had to be done. Right? It had to be done. Breakups suck, but I still care for him. I just wish everything didn't have to be so sucky. Okay. Here you go, dude. Mighty, you came back. Come on, let me hug you for a bit. <laughs> Laura and the kids will be ecstatic to see you again. They may show it by screaming at us and running away, but that's just You're their obsessed, way. Obsessed, dude. I'll take those. I feel empty inside. <laughs> inside my mouth, anyway. He'll be safer without his teeth. I just don't understand wives and children like I understand <laughs> crocodiles. Bitey, you don't judge me for coming home with chicken blood on me and smelling like I've literally been standing in a sewer for hours. Okay. <laughs> Ok, 
Can I in case it's tea? No. Who are you waiting for? Ted? Where are you? Alright. Okay. That doesn't work. Hmm. What do I give these horrifying teeth to? It's a new PA starry this toss. So I am lying in the gutter of this restaurant and its swine patrons. I can nevertheless show them the stars. From Beatrice. <laughs> yes, okay. sir. Let me just get this right. I never forget a smell. Those are the jerks that tortured me every day when I was a puppy. They tied oh, firecrackers to my tail. Gosh darn it. I'd eat them alive if only I had my teeth. I need yeah. teeth, darn it. Everything for revenge. It's good to be the big brother. Okay. Something that oh gosh, Rachel's gonna kill me if I don't make it to the disco competition on time. Only she won't, because <laughs> I'll already be dead. Because these guys are gonna kill me real soon. This is it, Ed. You're going to be dead soon, and you never went skydiving. You never ate caviar, and you never beat the Silver Surfer game for the NES. You're gonna die with regrets, Edo. Oh, if only I'd spent more time learning how to escape from trunks instead of learning the enemy attack patterns of the Silver <laughs> Surfer for the NES. Although, honestly, I'm glad I spent so much time playing Silver Surfer for the NES. Yeah, it you do tight. the same thing. Hey, what's the big idea? Get any closer and I'll get my brother to beat you up. But you have a gun. Something Typical. I have to do the hard labor while my big brother stands around and smokes. Hooray! You got born ten seconds earlier. That definitely means you have to never work a day in your life. Oh yes, absolutely. I deserve to be the guy mixing the concrete. Heck, if I didn't want to do that, I would have pushed my way to the front line 30 <laughs> years ago, right? Right. <laughs> Here's some tea, doggy. Beatrice? Is that uh, Beatrice? Where did you get those teeth? Uh, good doggy. Good doggy. Carry me, Luigi. Carry me in that run past the Luigi. Come by any time, boys. Uh, such a nice boy. Man, I charged Mario and Luigi one little convenience fee for ordering their concert tickets online. And this is how I end up... Convenience fees Dang. suck. I'm glad you're dead. Sleeping with the fishes isn't so bad. It's a great way for me to catch up on my sleep. Ooh, huh. and on my fish Good to have a positive attitude with this. Ooh. Hot dog. First, to save this guy. Help! Help! Yeah, yeah, I get Gosh, it. Gosh, Rich is gonna kill me. But how do I open the trunk? Hmm. Ooh, what's over here? Man. What's this for? Is it for the trunk? I don't know, that seems like a stretch. Oh, never mind. 
Nice! And it's not too late for the competition. How can I ever say thanks? Well, I, I could use a drive. I've got it. I'll dance for you, <laughs> and then we can talk about Silver Surfer. Uh, for the NES? Aw, oh, man, I really want to talk about this, but I'm late. Ed, you made it! Where were you? Locked in a trunk, but this stranger wandered in and helped me out. Uh, it's been a good day for that, I think. Let's dance. An amazing set! First place goes to <laughs> Rachel and Ed for their routine, Rachel's Education in Dance. This is an outrage. I bid good Papa morning to teeth. ensure my victory. I'm so angry, I could swallow my teeth. I could literally swallow my teeth. <laughs> I'll save you, Don. I'll save you, Don's teeth. <laughs> Okay. Can't You're still all about that. Dance train. My mouth feels lighter. <laughs> like there's, there's fewer teeth in it somehow. Don's actually. Yeah, it's about time you learned, you vain woman. And really God damn old. It. And I've got nothing in common with him. He's lost that sparkle somehow. Ed, buddy, it's been a long, strange day. Oops. In a crazy dance scene. Ed, buddy, it's been a long, strange day. But you're ending it in a crazy dance scene. So I think things worked out pretty okay. Wait for me to catch that It's time to <laughs> shake my butt and chew gum. And actually, I'd much prefer to shake my bod than chew gum. <laughs> so this is working out well. All right, my dude. Here's some teeth. These teeth are so sparkly. They feel good. They feel right. What am I doing here? I need to go show Barbara. Ooh, nice teeth. Barbara, I'm back. And I got a mouthful to say to you. Bernie, is that you? You're so sparkly. Oh, Bernie. It was you. Where You're the problem. Where did we go wrong? We didn't, Barbara. Just forget it. Everything <laughs> up to now is non-canon. Dude, you can do so much better. starts right now. Hey, thanks for the ride home, Bernie. Thanks for reminding me what's Good really important. Love. Sparkly teeth. Yeah, I think good oral hygiene is more important. Where am I? Where? I can't. Can I not scroll? Okay. Someone end me right now. End me! Just a few jumps away from home, where I can put all these hallucinatory spaghetti <laughs> arms and oddly accurate yeah, behind like me. Doe wood? Oh, a cat. Aline, I'm home. I've had the craziest day, honey. Uh, check it out. Think of a number between negative gazillion <laughs> and infinity plus three. Bet you 50 bucks I can read your mind. Okay. Eileen, I know that the arm sticking out of my head looks weird. The what? The, the arm it, sticking out of my head. I, I know it looks weird, uh, but There's no arm sticking out of your head. Ray, are you going nuts on me? <laughs> are you dropping insanity balls on the floor? No, I... Oh, I don't think so. You really can't see it? Sweetie, why don't you go she see my shrink? shrink? Dr. Egglesworth helped Whoa. me a lot. I'm okay. not afraid of grapes anymore, see? Ah, oh, jeez. Maybe I am crazy. I guess it wouldn't hurt to see Dr. Egglesworth. I believe his office is over okay. here, uh, to the right. But for now, thank you all for watching. I'll see you all in the next episode of Stick It to the Man. Man.